all things with tip so i'm back with another video i've been sitting at home i am like so 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 bored don't know what to do um i'll be glad when all of this is over i hope that you guys are staying healthy i hope that you guys are staying safe and let's just all pray and just pray that this will be over soon the people who do have it i pray that it god flushes it out of your body and you will be healed and that your family members don't catch it um just be glad when all of this is over with but since i've been home i have been thinking that i need to get back to my videos so i hope that you guys have seen my other videos that i've been doing um, that i published lately um, make sure you guys keep watching make sure you continue to share like and subscribe and i really appreciate it um, so today I wanted to do a video for you. I decided to press my hair. I've been wearing it natural probably about a month, month and a half and um, decided to press it out. I thought I was going to do my little short pixie cut that you saw in the video. Um, that was probably like a month or two ago when I did that. Um, but no, my hair has grown, which is a good thing because I do want it to get bob length. Um, that way I can start, you know, doing something different to it. Um, so letting it grow out and it's actually grown a lot more than I thought it had um, under this cap I look a hot mess I'm gonna show you guys I'm gonna do the reveal um, <laughs> but today I just wanted to show I'm gonna go back to wearing it natural and just wanted to kind of show you ladies and even maybe gentlemen if you um, wear your hair natural just kind of show you how um, what my daily routine is when it is natural um, to keep my hair moisturized throughout the day um, my hair doesn't get doesn't look dry and brittle looking it continues to stay moisturized throughout the day it feels moisturized and it actually has that look as well um, the products that I'm going to be using are some of the same products that I use in my other videos um, so these products they are for multi-use um, so make sure you guys stay tuned and I will be right back Okay, so we are going to go ahead and do the reveal first and then after the reveal I am going to do my shampoo I'm just gonna use um, for my shampoo I am going to use my um, Chi Argan oil shampoo and conditioner hope you can see that hope it's not blurry so I'm gonna do that for my shampoo and conditioner and I think that's it. Um, I don't want to take too much of the moisture out of my hair, so I'm not going to use the clarifying. That shampoo usually gets it pretty clean after two shampoos. And you don't have to use a lot. Um, just need a little bit. Um, so here we go. I already look crazy with this way I look now, but this, my hair looks a hot mess. So here's the reveal. <laughs> It has started reverting, and uh, so that's why I'm wearing the cap today. So it's just, it, it needs to be shampooed. But do you guys see how long it's gotten? Back in, it's now the end of March. Back in October, I cut my hair to my sides. I didn't have any hair on the sides. Couldn't curl it. Couldn't do anything but brush it. And so within those few months, it has grown a lot. So I'm happy to see this growth. I can also tell when my hair is growing when it's time to do my retouch for my color see all that new growth it's growing guys and so i'm just excited um i just can't wait till i get to the point where i want to be um so just stay tuned and i'll be back with you guys as soon as i'm done with my shampoo okay i'm back um so what i've done i shampooed my hair um and conditioned it and let me tell you so um the last time i went to sam's i meant to purchase olive oil for my cooking um instead i accidentally picked up avocado oil um so what i was like oh well i've you know heard people using avocado on their skin and in their hair so um i actually tried it today and i anytime i shampoo my hair i always try to um, cocktail my conditioner in some kind of way. I usually add some type of silk to it or some type of oil um, But today instead of adding my silk to it, I added the avocado oil and it did pretty good um, I guess I'll see like afterwards also um, 
and so so I'm shampooed I'm conditioned and this is afterwards it's actually really really soft it's probably a combination of the shampoo and the uh, avocado oil um, the avocado oil is also really good with cooking I'm gonna come back with my cooking videos and I'll show you guys um, that as well but it's really soft and fluffy I don't know if you can guys can see I got to get this lined up back here all right, so I'm not doing any kind of style. I'm just pretty much letting it grow out. Uh, while I am in this grow out stage, it is difficult. Um, so what I do is I start out putting grease in my hair. I use the Ducro Mega Long Grease. Um, this I've been using this for years and years and years. Every time I want my hair to grow, this is what I use. Um, and I don't touch my hair. I usually keep it braided up or you know some type of style where I'm not touching it um, And it has worked for me over the years and as you can see it is working now um, And I just put it on my scalp and then sometimes during my daily routine. I may put a little bit um, Mix a little bit in with what I normally put in my hair and rub it all together and just put it in um, So that's what I use do grow been using it for years Formula seems like it's still the same. Nothing, you know, it's still working. So as long as it's working, I'm gonna keep using it. Um, so let's go ahead and put this on my scalp. If you guys can see this shrinkage, that's why I didn't think my hair had grown so much. And then even whenever I wet it, it gets a lot, you know, shorter. I'm gonna add the product to it. Okay, start adding the product. to my hair I usually just style it with my fingers I try to bring it to the front a little bit to give it a little bit more style but this is how I keep my curls defined throughout the day and it doesn't get dry looking it you know I get a lot of compliments on it it's time to redo my color and my little straight pieces on the end I just kind of take those and push them in I uh, when I was wearing my hair straight I would run a little relaxer through it so my ends got a little bit more straighter than what I planned for them to alright so 
this is how I, I by the time I usually leave when it's well when you know before coronavirus um whenever I was I would do this and then it would take me almost an hour to get to work so by the time I got to work my hair was dry you can see the white all that in there and it looked like this just without seeing the product um and so this is how it will stay defined throughout the day um so i'm going to let this dry and then i'll come back and i'll let you guys see how it looks once it's dry um be back so i am back um my hair is almost dry um you can guys see it but as you can see it just gives the uh, curl or makes the curl a little bit more defined um, I have tried using the sponges before but it just does not work on my hair and it makes it look dry and brittle because my hair is so thick and coarse um, so this works best for my hair um, and as you can see the all the white um, stuff from the product that you saw earlier is starting to go away you can see a little bit because it's still a little wet um, but the curl looks more defined doesn't look so dry and sometimes before I leave or if I'm home and I'm waiting for it to dry I will just take some type of shine spray or um, some type of sheen or something to just mist it this right here is the do grow hair polish shine mist I hope you guys can see it all right and I'll just take that you don't need a lot because it's really oily and that's all I do and for you ladies that like your baby hairs you know you can take your baby hairs and you know style it do it the way you want but all I do I get up I do that in the morning sometimes I'll wet my hair in the shower um, and like I said, it takes me about 45 minutes to an hour, sometimes longer to get to work. So by the time I get to work, it's done, it's ready to go, and um, I don't have to do anything else to it. Um, the only thing I don't like about the natural style is, you know, you know, even though you protect your hair at night, when you wake up, then you still have to redo it. So I wish I didn't have to redo it in the morning. Sometimes I can get away with it. I'll just do my hair, you know, with my fingers really quick and I can get away with it. Um, but I like to have the more defined curl look so it doesn't look so dry. So this is what I've been doing. I hope that you guys enjoyed my video. So I hope that you guys are still staying safe and healthy out there. Um, any illness or disease or the coronavirus that someone may have I pray that God removes that from your body if you have any family members I pray that God removes it from your family members I just pray that God removes it from anyone that has it and just remove it completely so that no one's able to catch it anymore um, again thank you guys so much for watching if you're not subscribed yet make sure you ring that bell also make sure you like and share thank you guys so much again for watching i will see you next time you know what it is peace